Hi, Sean. How you been? I'm good. How have you been? I've been busy. Yeah, you have been, been busy. busy. You just won your third gold medal at the X Games. Congratulations. Yes. Thank That's you. All right. So uh, you had a fall. Oh yeah. I you had hurt a yourself. <clears throat> bit of a crash there. Mm -hmm. Where's where's the uh, there's like there's got to be some bad bad mark that you're. Uh, this finger's pretty. That's it. It's pretty banged I up. You, no, I, I've, yeah. I've had a bit of a raspberry here. Uh huh. The girls in the back were like, you can't so, go out like wait, that. Take a look at this. This is unbelievable. So and this then is uh, just. Oh. <laughs> now. Not my not my best move there. No. But, uh, how are you when when the, okay? So when you're coming down, you must be in the air knowing you're you're not going to make it that you're going to hit, right? Yeah. I mean, there's something about it. Right when I took off, I knew it was wrong, and um, I don't know. It's just like a halfway commitment. I mean, it's it's such a I don't know heavy trick to go into. You're doing multiple flips while spinning, and I don't know. I just took off. It was all wrong, and uh, as I came around, I just saw the the lip of the pipe coming at me, and it was it, you know so fast. And all I remember is like. Didn't I have a helmet on? You know what I mean? Well, I, yeah, because I mean, this this is just so. This yeah. could have been like just so. Ah, oh, <laughs> that could have been so much worse. So than... you know, you guys are watching this now, but the the funny part was I'm at the top of the pipe, and I have to do this trick in about you know a little bit of time, and you know I'm I'm last to drop because I uh, qualified first, and so I'm sitting there, and they keep replaying it and replaying. <laughs> I'm like, I hope I can do this. Like, yeah. <laughs> That's not the thing you want to look at over yeah, and over no, in your mind. You no. try to visualize success, not not something like that. Over yeah. now, does that that must give you because if you know, I mean, we only see you do perfection. So when yeah. something like that happens, does does it put doubt mm. into you? Does it affect your performance? Uh, it, it can. I mean, that's that's the thing. Is I hit and I I basically kind of did the check. Okay, I'm feeling all right. Next there, my jaw is still on, and <laughs> uh, I got to the bottom, and I just got really upset and angry and ran back to the top and did it immediately. Because if you don't do that and you give it too much time to breathe, um, you know, you'll start thinking about it. And it's such a, a, a do sport. You just do things. And, right. And uh, it's a feeling I get instead of looking around. So as I uh, got to the top, I just kind of forgot it ever happened, landed it, and then um, ended up winning the comp. So. Unbelievable. <laughs> Well, you started at what age, snowboarding? Uh, six years old. You were six. And mm -hmm. this is a great story. There was somebody that was snowboarding. How old was he? Oh, there's, um, there's a kid at the, the local skate park, and um, his name was Steve. And for some reason, I mean, he was about 18. I'm, I'm probably six, and I just had to beat him. <laughs> I had to be better than him. Uh, I think it was because he was friends with Tony Hawk. Uh -huh. And I had just met Tony. I was like, I want to be buddies with him. And, uh, and I've always been such a competitive person, but you put me in that scenario, and I, I don't know. That's like you know, I, had, it, I had a goal from the beginning. Well, that's and that's why you are who you are because you were driven at six years old to compete with an 18-year-old to say I'm going to be better than that guy. That's yeah. He kept getting better. It was really tough. Uh -huh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, are you less nervous now because of the first time around, uh, and this is your second oh, for time the Olympics? for the Olympics? You know, it's it's strange. I keep comparing last time to this time, and uh, I was 19 last time when I won, and. It's just so wild. I mean, you, you know, at that at that time, you think you know everything. You mm -hmm. know, like I'm 18. And, um, I'm sorry, I'm 19. I know everything. It's it's cool. And you know, obviously, that next week, I, I realized how naive I was. <laughs> you uh -huh. know, so I've been learning more and more. But I'm feeling really confident this yeah. time around. And, and it, it doesn't compare at all. I mean, it's it's its own time. It's its own. Uh, and you and you have new tricks that you've mm -hmm. actually come up with for for this Olympics, right? Yeah, that was one of them. Uh, it went a little wrong on that <laughs> uh -huh. one. Don't judge me from that. No, we're alone. not. We're but, not. Uh, yeah, basically there was an idea to go out into uh, the wilderness and just build a half pipe uh, out in Silverton, Colorado. And this is one of the tricks that I invented out there called the double McTwist 1260. Look at that. You are still in the air. You yeah. are still turning. See, the hard part about this is it's all blind until right there I can see where I'm going. Wow. Um, but at 1260s, just referring to the degrees of spinning, you know, if right. a 360 is a full circle, you just keep adding up to 1260 there. So. That is amazing. So that's yeah. something we're going to see. Yes, again, please. again. I hope. Yeah. All right. <laughs> well, we're all behind you. We're with you Thank and supporting you. you. So here's the thing: a lot of eyeballs watching the Olympics, a whole mm -hmm. lot, and there's, you know, you can't watch the advertisements for it without you. It's all about you, really. You know that, right? Where every everybody's watching uh -oh. you. No, no pressure. No pressure. <laughs> but so when you're uh, out there, I know you have to wear a helmet. Of course, yes. we saw that. So when you're wearing your helmet, this <laughs> is uh, the yeah. flag of yeah. uh, right there. That okay. Could work. That could...
can work. Okay. Is that, is that good? Yep. While I'm flipping. Yeah. While you're <laughs> flipping, so it really is going to spin. It'll be very impressive. And uh, here's a, a great, it's all your stuff, too. It's yeah, your, yeah. your clothing line. And then you'd wear that. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, li I like it. All right. I like it. <laughs> Andy, you're up in the air a lot spinning, so while yeah. you're up in the air. <laughs> I think uh, yeah. that this could just work. Yeah. So this could be my you think, ticket. To you the think goal. I'm kidding, but I'm not. <laughs> so I want to see this when I'm watching the Olympics. And uh, this and is by far my favorite. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you feel free to wear all of them together separately, okay. however you want to wear them. And uh, when you when you win the gold medal, mm -hmm. and uh, you come back and see us wearing uh, this or not. Yeah, but, yeah. But please come back and see us, and and uh, and have fun. Be safe, and we're all supporting you. Thank you. Thank you.